is Phnom Penh really safe? Well, in this video, I'm gonna walk along the back alleys of Phnom Penh with my camera on my face and let's see if anybody try and do anything to me. I might do a night time as well. I mean, I have filmed videos at night before here. You just need to check out my other videos or go to my playlist in Cambodia or I'll put a link in the description. I'm a bit ill here. But yeah, I'm just walking on the back alley here in the early afternoon. Yeah, but how safe is Phnom Penh or Cambodia? Well, if you look at the statistics, it is safer now than it is before. Yeah, it was before. So I'm just walking here to my hostel with my camera. Now I'm just walking. Filming with my right hand here and purposely pulling out my camera to the road. See if anybody try to snatch it. Using my phone on the street here. I'm gonna have to turn right. I should be going straight there. I'm going in the wrong direction. Yeah. I've been walking along Phnom Penh in the back district in let's use my left hand here and see if anybody trying to snatch it yeah but no one has been trying to do or no one has tried to do anything to me people just smile here and they don't do anything to you so my conclusion is Phnom Penh is safer than it used to be and although you still have to be careful though like everywhere else in the world you, you can't just be loitering alone when you see any potential dangers but generally it is safe let's see here where I am let's get off the street here I don't want to get run over So I should be going straight, I guess. I'm really confused here right now. Turn left onto Watco Street 81. Um, yes, I should be going straight ahead into that alley. Let's go to another alley here, although it's not at night. But I have filmed videos in the alley before. It is safe. It wasn't before, but I think for now it is quite safe. Let's keep filming. Turn left onto Oak Natrong Kang Street, 158. Using my phone again. I have to make a left and then I'll be at my hostel. Let's see here. Yep, another alleyway. Let's go into the alleyway again. Is it really safe? It is. In the morning, of course. This is a Morning, day, afternoon review of how safe Phnom Penh is. Alright, I'm almost at my hostel. So I shall see you on my next video. Like and subscribe. Alright. So I just had my breakfast and look at the streets here, the condition of the streets 
it's really really congested and that's one of the reasons why I do not like to ride my moped here because it is absolutely congested and I can't be bothered so I'm gonna walk to a shopping mall or a supermarket that I saw on the Google map and I need to get myself some flu medicine starting to get ill here probably because of the the bike ride that I did yesterday whereby I inhale a lot of the dust from the roadside here from the roads and yeah, I need to find myself a medicine but anyway, I thought I'd film myself walking along the roadside here in Phnom Penh and share my experiences with you guys a little bit about how I'm feeling Phnom Penh here at the moment I've been here for three days now on the first day I did the usual touristy thing like seeing around the city and all but now I'm just walking and trying to see more of the city and I made a video talking to you guys about the the reason that I came to Phnom Penh was actually not to visit the temples it's just to see the city and trying to help out the local economy here a little bit yeah so you have to be careful here when you're um, walking along the street you see what these guys does is that they catch people using phone and they probably take a fine out of them so if you're riding do not use your phone and do not beat the red light but then of course as a foreigner you can always pay pay up these guys and then they'll let you go let's see here am I walking on the right track I'm going to Bayon supermarket so I should be going straight ahead let's wait for the lights here oh look at these guys they're all on the pavement on some places they do not have traffic lights especially on the countryside yesterday where I, I was right riding there We're waiting for the green man yeah so my experiences in Phnom Penh has been fantastic price are relatively cheap but not as cheap as Phuket I guess or probably cheaper yeah it's a bit cheaper here despite they're using US dollar gonna cross the road waiting for the green man Yeah, I'm really ill here, down with a flu and a headache. The headache has receded but the flu is still with me. I was actually going to do another village adventure on my moped but I'm not feeling it at the moment. I'm a bit ill. And the village I'm going to uh, is probably about a three hour ride away. And yeah, three hours ride and then three hours ride back. But yeah, let's cross the road here. Green man. And then let's walk straight ahead. If I can walk somewhere straight. Maybe let's walk on the grass pad here. Hopefully it's alright. It rained heavily yesterday at about 2 or 
3 a.m. And I'll have to jaywalk here. Hopefully none of those police officers will catch me. See, we're about five minutes in. I need to get onto the other side. Let's just make a dash here. Yeah. Cleaning up his wheels in his moped. I guess that's the financial tower. I could be wrong again, like I said, I have all my facts mixed up a lot of times here when I'm making these travel videos. Don't count on me to tell you the facts. Because you'll never get it. Let's film more of the street here than my face. Probably the place where you, you come to repair your cars, repair your mopeds. Let's see here, am I still walking in the right direction? Almost. I have to make a left in front there. Peng Hui Autocars. Peng Hai actually. Oh, what are they making here? Let's have a look. What are you making? Hopefully I'm not distracting them. Okay, bye bye. Have a good day. Alright, I'm back again. I just got my stuff. And now I'm going back to my hostel to crash. I got some aspirin and some flu ointment. Now I'm going back to my hostel. Walking on this back alley here. No one has tried to attack me. No one has tried to steal my money. People are kind here. Or is it too soon for me to say? But I doubt it. Cutting down the trees there. Let's make a right here. Let's check if I'm at the right place. Uh, my maps is not loading at the moment. Yep, I'm gonna make a right here. This is a temple. And yeah, I think I'll call it a day for now. I'm not really feeling up to it to vlog right now, so I'm just gonna head back to my hostel and crash and then probably do a night market tour. So I'll see you on my next video. Like and subscribe. See ya. That's be done here. Till we meet again.